Hey, you guys, guess what time of day it is? It is not Dollar Tree time, it's a surprise. I'm actually crafting time. You're not going to see my face on camera, you're only going to see my little hands with my little nail polish on there. That's it, that's all. You know what I'm saying? Is this thing on? It is on. I just had to make sure. So, you know, I don't edit anything. I don't do, I don't, I'm not fancy like that. It is what it is. But, uh, I thought I would bring to you guys a couple things that I've been doing. Working on a bunch of Christmas cards. Laid up from recovering from surgery. Got my little uh, gnome coffee mug going on. Love it, love it, love it. It's not a coffee mug today. It's a hot tea because I'm suffering from a cold. I'm suffering, folks. I'm suffering. So, anyways, to kind of pass the time, I've, I've come up with some cards I made out of my stash, using up my stash. So if this is a time of year when you're making cards. Yes, it's better to do it in mass quantities, okay? It gets done quicker and you get a lot more done. But if you're just doing a card at a time here and there, recovering like I am or whatever, what have you, <clears throat> use up your stash. If you only got a couple of one thing and one of another, use it up if you can. I mean, for all, you know, if that's what you choose to do. You can do whatever you want with cards. You can stamp, you can glitter them, you can emboss them, you can, you know, I've, I, I'm i hoping I can find the ones that I did. Here's the ones. I'll show these to you guys real quick. If you don't want to do all that fancy stuff, okay, then you can do, um, I took the box cards. There should be another one in here. Where'd it go? Right here. Okay. The box cards from the Dollar Tree and from Dollar General. So these three right here are from the Dollar Tree. Okay. Did I do anything to this one? Not yet. I haven't done anything to this one. So it's just basically, I thought there was more to this, but maybe there's not. Oh, here it is. Okay. I knew there was one more. Actually, two more. Okay. So this was from the Dollar Tree from a couple years ago. Okay. What I added to this was... Um, it says home for the holidays, and then I just added some a little bit of washi tape right here. And it says, wishing you a very Merry Christmas wherever the season takes you, okay? The other thing I added to this was I put some of these, the, um, oh, let me see if these things are called. I don't have them right here in my face. They look like this. They, they're Nouveau um, Crystal Drops. Looks like that. I have a set of these. I got, you know, green, yellow, purple, and some other glossy or uh, sparkly ones. These just add embellishments. So, like, I took and put this on the um, the snowflake that was already there. Put some light bulbs in there, a little tree. Just kind of embellished it up a little bit. I put the wheel wells in there, or not the wheel wells, but the tire little things on there. And then this was one from uh, the Hallmark store. American Greetings. This came from last year when I got, I think I got this for 90% off. So this is Making Spirits Bright. This is the gnome. All I did was this. I put, added it to the snowflake. That's all. Um, and then this one, I just added um, some washi tape to it. Washi tape, washi tape. And it said, just for something a little extra. This is another Dollar Tree home for the holidays. I did the tires and the, these like this. I don't believe it anything inside of here. Oh, I did do some washi tape, but I did do this. So, what do you think of that? That's just box cards, you guys. Again, here's another one. This was from Dollar General. Just tis the season. Little red truck, because you guys know I like my red trucks. Looks like that. Just gives it a little bit more sparkle, you know? Um, so, by all means, you don't have to do homemade cards. You can take, you know, what you have. Or for crying out loud, just send out cards. You don't have to do anything if you don't want to. If you're not a crafter, you're just not going to be a crafter. But if you're a crafter, you want to get rid of your stash, by all means, do it up, sisters and brothers. So, let me get a little uh, taste of my coffee here. I wish I had some whiskey in there. That would taste delicious. I hate having cold to turn to a big baby. Okay. So... I'm just going to kind of run down and see, let you see what I've done so far. These are just basic cards. Okay, this says, follow the law, Mary and Bright. I added a tag to this, like this. And then I have a place where I usually live in blank, or I might put Happy Holidays or something inside of there. So there's that. And then I was just going to just kind of 
do show you how I do this really quick. So I cut cut this up to the measurements of my card. Um, and then I use this stuff. It's called Art Glitter Glue. You know, I am not sponsored by these guys, but if they do see me and they want to sponsor me, let me know. This stuff is the best stuff in the world. This replaced all of my tape runners. I have tape runners now that I haven't used in years. Um, because this stuff works like a freaking champ. So, go get yourself some. Alright, so I take my little glue and I just do it like this. And you just go back and forth and like that. Now, if it's a big card, I'll use double-sided tape and this. But this isn't a giant card. It's just a wee widow one. Okay, so we're going to put this on here. Sometimes you got to be careful because you might mess up. All right, there we go. All right, that's down. So, um, like I said, I was going to uh, do another tag, I think. Um, and then put something on here. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to put on there yet. So we're going to think about that. I got some stuff I cut up out of um, one of my things. My books. No, I don't like that. Let's see. Let's see what this one does. Peace, love, and joy. I like that. Let's see. Peace, love, and joy. That looks like it fits right where it's supposed to, huh? Yeah. Let's do her up. Let's do her up. I know you guys have been asking for some crafty videos, and I apologize. This is not my forte. I don't know why I feel so self-conscious about it. I don't feel like I do a fantabulous job. But, hey, I'm going to give it a try. Why don't you guys give it a try? Now, I thought about if, um, I don't know, figuring out something like a contest, um, but it might be too late in the year. I'm not sure how I'm going to work that out. So, all right. So then I need some sort of a talk amongst yourselves, people. That'll work. All right. Just because of time wise, I don't know where my little charmy things are. I also have one in here. I might have something in here. I don't know. Let me see. Nope. 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 I do not see one. Okay. So we're just going to go to plan B and make one up out of this stuff. might work. Let's see if we can get that to that be better. Let me look, let me look, let me look. It's a flower. We'll see if this flower makes sense. Sometimes if it's a spring flower that doesn't make much sense, you know what I'm saying? Alright, here we go. Oh yeah, that makes sense. Alright, we're gonna use that. Alright, so we got ourselves a little embellishment here. A little flower dewy dad. We're gonna just put some of that on there. I drop that on there like that. That's going to dry clear, just so you know. So no worries. And then we're going to take this and we're going to glue this down. And, um... Put this across here like this. Alright, there's that part. And then I had, um... That's my kind of fun to put on here, let's see. <laughs>
There, how's that look? That looks pretty. And it's just some little touches to your Christmas card, and you can leave that blank. Um, I mean, you could also put some washi tape up here, make that look a little bit more festive, that kind of thing. So there's that card. All right, let's see. Let's go to this one. This was kind of fun to do. This says, Happy Holidays. I love this stand. I can't find, I have more, but I don't know where they went. And then it's just blank on the inside, so you can add your own sentiments. So I stamped it, used some jewels, used this cute little sexy Santa, happy Santa, something Santa. So I've got one sitting right here. How many minutes we got into this thing? Okay, we're doing good. We're doing good, we're doing good, we're doing good. Okay. All right, so... First thing we're going to do is I take this, we're going to line this up good. There's that. Take this, I take this, go right down here. Just for this has got stickiness to it, but sometimes these that can sit. Oh, this is from when K is for Karen got me these like 10 years ago. Gosh, Karen, I wish I could find more of these. Love this stuff, I use it all the time. All right, so there's that. Then what we do. We take and we glue our little card on the inside. Alright, we got that part. We're going to put this in the inside of the card. There is that. All set there. Alright. I don't know what you didn't. Okay, so we're going to take this little thing I have here. This is called cheating. We're cheating. Not use, not really. We're just using up our stuff, you know. Had this stuff for a long time. Long, long time. All right, so we're going to do the Merry Christmas right here. We're going to take this right here. Oh, I should have put that underneath there. And I think it's too late to get that back up. No, nope, it's too late. So, that's okay. We're just going to go like this. We're just going to go across this way. Let me get my scissors. What do I do with them? I had them a minute ago. That's all right. We'll just use this. My trusty little cutter. Perfect. Okay, so then we're going to take this. We're going to go around here on a really quick. All right. Going to go like that really quick. Then we got these little uh, felt stickers, and you get four of them in here. And I paid, uh, I got these for like 50 cents last year when the Time was off, or uh, it was right after Christmas. And there we go. So, kind of sort of the same. Simple as that. Making cards is fun, it's relaxing if you have your stuff laid out. Um, I try real hard to keep things laid out the best I can. This is another one that I made the Santa's Ho 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 Ho. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! And I'm going to leave this one for later. I wanted to um, also show you some of the other cards that I made. Um, I guess I do this in my head. Sorry, I'm banging around. I just had the doggone things. Oh, here they are. At least it's going to lose your mind. Okay, so. Just show you some of the other crafty goodness that I, I did also. Uh, 
may your home be filled with the season with the joy of the season so that's just your basic card and then I put in here um, it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas and this one is seasons of wonder and Merry Christmas so seasons of wonder Merry Christmas tis this is one of my favorites tis the season to be jolly and I hand wrote this and then this is from our home to yours again I hand wrote that Merry Christmas I like these little house things Merry memories let's be merry I like how this turned out it kind of got wonky on me and here's another ho 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 Merry Christmas and then I had that ho-ho over there, and then I moved the ho-ho over here. Like this ho-ho better. Like that ho-ho better, but I like this ho-ho better, the hat. Have yourself a Merry Little Christmas. It's another one I like, the Merry Christmas with the pretty thing I call him. And this is another one I embellished with the stuff. Happy Holidays. Merry and Bright. Let's be merry, happy holidays. So there's merry and bright. Let's be merry, happy holidays. And this one wasn't too fancy smancy, but this is Tis the Season. Tis the Season. You warm my heart. It looks like of that. So there is those for now. Um, I did have a lot of fun making these cards. I think I'm going to stop now because I have a lot of cards to get out. Um, I am having a card exchange. If you want to go to um, my email, lisa.m.shepardson, S-H-E-P-A-R-D-S-O-N, at gmail.com, put in the subject line, Christmas cards, so I know what to be looking for, um, and I will send you one if you send me your address. Um, so there you go. I thought that would be a lot of fun to do. And um, the other thing I wanted to show you that I did, where would those go? Right here. These were last year's, or two years ago, these wooden gift tags that had the bumblebee on it and the, the, the honey pot and stuff like that. They were meant for like an outdoor thing. I took them and embellished them. So there is that. It says Noel. And I put some embellishments and things like that. And then you flip this over. This is a Dollar Tree gift tag. And I just put that on there and you can make it jingle. And you put this on an easel, um, and that makes it look nice and kind of festive. And this is one I'm working on. I'm not quite finished with it yet, but it goes like this. It's at Christmas, all roads lead to home. Got the red truck on there, and the birds, pine cones, and a tree. Flip it over, and I got um, <clears throat> some different wreaths and things like that. So I thought that was kind of fun. So I enjoyed that. So you can put these on easels quite easily and um, just make it a little festive for yourselves or a gift for somebody else. Um, I think I'm going to end this video because I've got lots to do, but I just wanted to show you guys what you can do with some cards. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask me them. I want you to like, comment, share, subscribe down below. Remember snail mail because everybody likes getting something good mail says a damn bill. Um, do something good for yourself so that you can do something good for somebody else. And above all else, what do I always say? Be good. I love you guys. Talk to you soon.